Where should I begin? I think that corner is great. So this tipping hats, June twenty second. So this is what we did to the the basement to fix the leak. Is, well, we rerouted the pipe. We basically we have our AAV in this corner right here, which was there before. So we just took it and put it on the end of the run. This is close to the close to the radiator. Um, we have one inch coming from here. We maintain our one inch. Uh, we had inch and a quarter in the floor. We got that out of the floor, so we wanted to keep our inch and a quarter horizontal and basically route it over to the other wall where we could eliminate that pipe in the floor, which was rotten. So we used ProPress fittings, Mega Press to be exact, on iron iron, iron pipe. Uh, we maintain pitch to the desired location, and then we've we've got inch and a quarter coming all the way to this T, where we transition to inch and a half. Uh, we did have inch and a quarter coming up here, but we made it inch and a half just because I needed this T right here. This would have been the T that was in the floor right there. Remember on the old system? Correct. We had a T, so we just switched the T to the wall. So we needed to maintain inch and a half on the downstream side of that T, which we have done. It catches this from another location that we didn't we didn't touch that. Um, and then we've got these. We've got a 90 right there. And that's another mega press. That's another mega press fitting. Um, Concrete's a, going all the way underneath yep. the drywall. Got another fitting right there. Again, we've got pitch from that corner at about an eighth, between an eighth and a quarter, all the way to here. Um, and then that continues on the other side, inch and a half iron pipe. We, and it was Rust-Oleum painted. We did paint it. We did paint it. I think that uh, they, that they can said, they, said risk. They said that it wasn't necessary, but we did it anyway, just yeah. because. And why I, not, right? <laughs> yeah, right. And I had the paint. You used the, my rust. I did the rust oleum that you had in the garage. Great, super. Well, that's what it's for. Yeah, it says it prevented rust. So okay. <laughs> and then, of course, we go under that wall. Can we come up under here? We can leave that if you want, uh, or we can backfill it. That's Back concrete. It. I'm gonna put a. I'm gonna put a bucket around that union though. Okay, <clears throat> that's a good idea. And then we'll fill in concrete around the bucket. Correct. Not like a, a little bucket, a sleeve or something. Yeah, like a like maybe my little brawny bucket. So that's <clears throat> the original area that was dry as a bell for 25 years, and then when we. Uh, discovered the leak after the boiler was done. Yeah. That's that's the original where they started excavating to try and fix it, right? Correct. Yeah. And they had gone somebody Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. That was before I came in here, but we'll we'll put concrete back. 